how have you become so prolific as an author? What's your process? I'll give you the secret. It, to me, it is literally the most important activity I do in my professional life is to write and nothing can stop that in, in my mind. Literally this morning, 6 a.m., I was writing. And to do this, I've, I'm with other authors. So every weekday, 6 a.m. Eastern to 7 a.m. Eastern, minimally, there's a group of authors getting together and writing. And we just write. Um, I, I produce in that hour, 800 to 1,000 words. Most of it is garbage. But that means 5,000 words a week. Uh, that means 250,000 words a year. And uh, that, that's a couple of books. That's in the off season. When I'm in the in season, like this is just the completion of a season for me of, of writing this book. This is what's called past pages. It's just all the, uh, I'm doing final proofreading of my own book. Right, right. And um, when I'm in the in season writing, then I'll write for four, maybe five hours a day. Wow. And, and then I'm producing maybe five, four to 5,000 words a day. And so now you can just see, it really is a game of quantity. You know, I remember like listening to athletes and stuff like the best athletes you hear, everyone leaves the field. These are pro athletes. And Jerry Rice runs another hour of sets, just practicing reception patterns and stuff like that. I'm like, oh, the elite go that much further every single day, not just once, but every single day. And uh, for years now, every single day, 6 a.m., I'm writing, period. Wow. No, no, no other choice. That, that's interesting because I have always viewed it. I think I've viewed this process like a project. Oh, yeah. we'll start it and we'll finish it. But no, if you're going to write books, like it is a thing you do. You used to, I am an author and I have to write the books or I'm not going exactly to finish it basically. Yeah, it, it's a vocation. It is a necessity. Yeah. There is no alternative. That, that's how I see it. Uh, so you, when you meet with this group of authors, is that in person? Is that on Zoom? Is that like friends? That one's in Zoom. Group? Yeah. So yeah. we connected Zoom. I also, it's funny. I, I also found uh, there's a great, great way to get you into a, a room of people you want to connect with and simply to facilitate or organize an event. So there's some really established authors, a group of guys that I'm really impressed by. Um, a guy wrote Atomic Habits, James Clear. Oh yeah. Um, Don Miller, Story Brand, Ryan Holiday, some other guys. And uh, I was like, Ooh, if I could connect with these guys, this would be a dream come true. So I reached out to each one of them and said, Hey, I'm putting together an event cost nothing. I'll take care of all the logistics, everything. We just come and all we're going to do is share information with each other. And uh, we, we flew, this is last year. We flew down to Don Miller's house and I'm sitting there and I'm just aghast. Like I'm surrounded by these people that I aspire <laughs> to be yeah, one one hundredth as, as impactful as they are as, as authors. And I'm like, I can't believe I'm here with these guys, but I, I can't believe it's I'm the one who facilitated it. I think that's an opportunity for all of us. It doesn't matter what level you're at. You can be with the people at the next level and, and start behaving like them. If you simply help them gather, because no one really wants to put in that effort. Most of the stuff I write sucks. I mean, it's, it's, it was written for the garbage, but the, but the good few pieces I would have never discovered unless I got all that garbage out Yeah. So every single day, just write, 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 